Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Neil and welcome back to another episode of BeamNG Quickies. Today we are going to be checking out a little UI mod that adds cheat codes into BeamNG Drive, the sandbox game with cheat codes. Not really cheat codes per se, uh, but just some weird things to mess with the game, which we always love to see. So you'll see it over on the left here. It literally just says cheat panel. Now, what can we do? We can do some pretty cool stuff. So we have our car right here, bright orange. Well, we can enable rainbow mode. And as you can see, <laughs> we have magical car paint now that is just continuously uh, changing colors. You can even drive while it does that. Kind of trippy if I'm not if I'm going to be honest here, kind of trippy, but I kind of dig it. I feel like this is going to be something that we will see uh, in the next 20 to 30 years in real life. You can get a car uh, with a programmable paint color. I don't know. I feel like that would be... That doesn't seem like completely out of the realm of possibility, does it? I don't think it does. Or maybe like you can wrap the car in like a, a special kind of wrap that can do this. I think it would be... Uh, really cool. Let's go ahead and crash this thing, by the way. While we're here, as it's changing colors, it's going to land on uh, lime green. Uh, when we uh, made contact, we can also turn this off at any point. If you see a color you like, if you're quick to the trigger, you can actually just stop it uh, mid-phase. And you can also change the roughness as well. I don't know if we need rainbow mode. Hold on. Let's get back in the sunlight here. So I believe roughness just means how shiny, yeah, yeah, how shiny it is. You see the, the shine go away. I kind of like it somewhere a little bit closer to more shiny, but with a little bit of roughness. Anyway, uh, next up, we have drift mode, which I guess just changes some variables to make this thing a little bit more drifty, I guess. I, that's, I, can, I can assume that that's what it does. Uh, let's see if it gets a little bit easier to control. Okay. Not easier to control, but it is a lot more drifty. Oh, that's kind of cool, actually. That's really cool. That's really cool. We're going to crash anyway. No. I mean, I've never claimed to be good at drifting, so <laughs> I don't know how much that option is going to help me. But it is neat for turning any non-drag car uh, in effectively into a drag car, which is pretty darn cool. So next up we have drag mode, which I believe just adds more torque. I could be wrong. Or maybe it just, does it just literally make us faster? I mean, this isn't like the fastest car ever, but it looks like we are about, what, what, what speed are we going to be at? 115 miles an hour at the finish line. So let's turn this off and see if it actually does does anything i will say this is um being worked on as we speak so there might be some glitches and weird stuff uh that you see but it was just so cool i had to try it out and it looks like we're gonna be going the exact same speed <laughs> i want to say the drag uh adds more torque so it's not turning it into a drag car it makes it good at dragging stuff because you got more torque i i guess i guess that's what that means i i, I don't really know i don't Okay, next up we have WTF mode, which I guess just randomly changes some variables with um, with uh, friction and stuff like that. So I'm curious what this is actually going to do and what's going to happen if we try to slide the car. Oh, it puts us right into the wall. Oh, no. We have no friction. No friction whatsoever. The tires have exploded into time and space. I'm not pushing anything right now. Oh, no. We're going to do a sick grind. <laughs> yes. Okay. Okay. So that effectively gave us no friction. So does that mean if I... No? The brake still works. Is it only when I start sliding? that we become frictionless or, or was that a one-time deal? Is it different every time I reset the car? I don't know, man. I do not know. Hold on. Okay, so I'm, I'm not pushing anything right now. <coughs> oh no, here we go again. Yeah, that's very strange. 
Once you get going, if you slide, you're done for. You're sliding off into the endless abyss. Unless something stops you, of course. Now, can I turn on the rainbow at the same time? I can, yes! Oh no! Just in time for it to be exploded into a million pieces, flattened like a pancake. Okay, let's put this thing out of its misery. Let's turn this off and let's turn that off. So next up we have indestructible engine, which um, I guess would be good if you drop like just a super crazy engine that's not equipped to be in the car that you want. Um, <laughs> so not exactly. I mean, I guess I could try it on a drag car. Uh, because drag cars, they do have like a limit to how far they can actually go before stuff starts to go bad. So let's get a blue buck drag out here. And first we got to change the colors. There we go. There we go. Dark blue. Why not? Indestructible engine. Let's see if it is in fact indestructible. If we see smoke, I'm going to assume it didn't work. We are heating up, but is it going to damage us? Oh no, I, I, I'm going to run out of road. I'm running out. Uh-oh. I meant to do that. I meant to do that. Keep it up. We're going to keep going. <laughs> yeah, it's not breaking though. Usually it would be at least be smoking by now. But, uh... Indestructible. Well, clearly not. It's not. It's dead. But <laughs> you get the point. And then, uh, what's what's more power do? I guess it gives us more power or more torque. Whoa! Yeah, that's torquey. Very torquey. Just we drove the back wheels off the car. Oh my sweet Jesus! That's a little insane, mate. Just a little bit insane. I think we broke something, actually. Uh-oh. <laughs> that was an especially crunchy crunch right there. Did you guys notice that? Look how shiny this thing is as well. There we go. Oh, it's just... It, uh, 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 Get it back down. Get it back down. Let's try that again now, buddy. Let's try it again. We'll go in gear. Oh, we broke it. Okay, I guess we only have one shot at this. Let's go first person. The inside, the inside's blue as well. Beautiful. Oh, yeah, you can just hear the back tires getting driven off this thing, and we are flipping through the air. Not good. Not good at all. Anyway, guys, that's about all we have today for the cheat panel. Uh, yeah, cheat panel. Uh, quick little mod, but a fun little mod. I, I, I like stuff like this. I didn't even know it was possible to, like, uh, change the color without like resetting the car, but apparently you can apparently you can and I think it's 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 psychedelic man I love it and the other stuff is cool as well uh, Especially I like the drift one and the the frictionless mode cool stuff Anyway, I'll have a link down below if you want to check it out for yourself while you're down there Why don't you go ahead and hit that like button and subscribe? If you haven't already and I will talk to you guys in the next one peace